Instruction at some schools isn't just related to book knowledge. Students are also learning about health and wellness. Joining me now are Natalie Steed with the Institute for America's Health and also Jana Harlan with Southeast Dairy Association. Thank you both for being here. Thank you. Glad to be here. Thanks. I understand we're going to learn about Fuel Up to Play 60. What is that? Fuel Up to Play 60 is a program that was developed by the National Dairy Council and the National Football League and we're working together to teach children to fuel up with the nutrient-rich foods like low-fat and fat-free dairy, fruits and vegetables, and whole grains and get at least 60 minutes of physical activity every day. Mm -hmm. But we're, what we're doing is we're empowering the kids to be the leaders because nobody listens to um, other kids like the kids do. So we want them to teach the children how to go out and get active and eat the right foods. Mm -hmm. Okay, Jana, but also um, Natalie, right. how do the schools get involved? The schools get involved with Fuel Up to Play 60 through mm -hmm. Jana and okay. they'll sign up with yes. her. Okay. Right? And mm -hmm. yeah, what they have to do is they go to fueluptoplay60.com and mm -hmm. sign up and there they can sign up as a student and as an advisor or even as a supporter. And the kids, when they sign up, they can go online and make a pledge and um, saying that they're going to fuel up with the nutrient rich foods mm -hmm. like low fat dairy and be active for at least 60 minutes every day. Okay, has it been going on so that you can tell us how is it going? Yes, it has been going on for several years now. We um, started out as a pilot program in um, several different states and it's been going now for three years and we are um, we are providing funding to these schools to help them initiate it and keep it going to sustain it throughout their school. Mm -hmm. Now Natalie, you're with the Institute of America's Health. That's Tell right. me about your partnership and how it came right. along. We're working with the schools. We're able to provide health and wellness resources to the classroom teachers and all of our activities align to the state standards and core subjects such mm -hmm. as language arts, math, social studies, and science. But it not only meets those requirements but also the national health standards, character education, and also recommendations from programs like Fuel Up to Play 60. Mm -hmm. And we're able to offer that in Alabama free of charge to any classroom teacher that wants it thanks to generous support from the State Department of Education. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Now Jana, tell me when you uh, point out these items or these food items to the kids, how do they react when you say, okay, here's a bowl of carrots, <laughs> yeah. have your broccoli? Actually, it's wonderful because the kids, a lot of these children, especially in inner city areas, do not have the opportunity to try, um, you know, some of these fruits and vegetables or even yogurt parfait. Yogurt with the granola, yeah. I mean, so, you know, if you want to play 60, we, um, there are plays that they can access on online tools mm -hmm. that give them um, recipes for different types of foods that are healthy for the children to choose. Mm -hmm. And so the kids are a great response. They can vote on it even to go onto the menu. Okay, give us your website so that we can leave folks with um, that. Fuel, it, fuel up to play 60com mm -hmm. and all you do is go on and sign up, or you can even check to see if your school is already involved. Dana, Natalie, thank you so much thank, for being thank here you and for sharing. Us. All right, absolutely great work.